My name is David Harris, and I am a comedian and a magician. Thank you. I started performing magic in bars when I was 15 years old. Right up close to people's tables. There's always that one drunk guy. Hey, can you make my wife disappear? <laughs> you know what, sir? I'm surprised she's not gone already. <laughs> now pick a card. It's great to be here. Uh, last show, actually, I drove with my new lady friend, uh, but she was yelling at me the whole time. She's like, recalculating, recalculating, recalculating. I was like, shut up, Garmin! <laughs> she hates that because her name's Top Top. <laughs> but, <I've, laughs> but I'm glad I have her. I'd be lost without her. Yeah, get ready. There's going to be a lot more bad ones like that, all right? I'm the kind of guy that goes to the game and notices everything else that happens. Like when you buy a drink, they'll actually take and remove your bottle cap. You notice that? Sometimes they'll, they'll do it at a bar too, if you guys have ever been to a bar. <laughs> you're school teachers, you're not supposed to be <laughs> drinking. <laughs> well, maybe they should be less worried about the cap and more worried about the bottle. <laughs> That's it, hey, right? Yeah. I live on the edge of North Minneapolis, which is considered a dangerous area by some, but nothing's ever happened except my roommate got his laptop stolen. I might give it back, I haven't decided yet. <laughs> and uh, this is, I brought a little bit of bad weather with you. A little snowball. <laughs> okay, it's a piece of foam. Uh, it's a little yellow, I have a dog that lives nearby, but don't worry about that. No one wants that bad weather, right? That's the key, right? It's okay, hold your applause again, it's fine. Open your hand like this here for me, Cara. Perfect, I want you to squeeze tight for me. Not my hand, all right? <laughs> that was nice, though. Uh, Turn your hand over like this for me, Cara, okay? Let's, uh, let's do this, all right, yep. Repeat after me. Repeat uh, after me. Okay. But he gave me medication, which was helpful. Um, uh, I, have, I take it for anxiety, OCD, and depression. It's a super pill, I have to eat it with a fork. I have to cut it with a knife in order to get the right dosage and I kind of feel like a drug lord in my bathroom. <laughs> it's like, hey man, you want to get totally stable with me tonight? I'm in the mirror. <laughs> We're gonna get so normal. <laughs> We're gonna drink bottled water and eat wheat thins and... Wear sweater vests. <laughs> you didn't feel anything happen? No. Okay, uh, wave over just like this. This time go uh, uh, Sioux Falls School District. Sioux Falls School District. 749. I don't know the number. Uh, <laughs> do your research before the show. <laughs> it's only 1500. Uh, <laughs> Teachers are like, I make that in a month! <laughs> did you, did you feel anything happen? No. Okay, I actually felt something happen. I felt the ball leave my hand just like that. Hold on now, did you feel anything happen in your hand? Should be all gone open your hand just like that?
Costello up here. <laughs>